I drove into the town of Temple, Texas, because I had a gig at Moose and Goose Winery. Temple is located about midway between Austin and Waco, about an hour's drive from Austin. And some have said it's a big town with a small town mindset. So you kind of have small town hospitality here while at the same time having big town sort of amenities and things to do. It is a very family oriented town. I think there's a lot of families who get drawn here because it doesn't have all that big city chaos that you typically expect. And it's got a railroad museum too. So I guess kids like that, right? They like trains. They got the downtown there area surrounded by the courthouse, and it's pretty walkable. You can uh, walk around and check out the uh, nice style of buildings that they have, get intrigued by them, pop into some restaurants, maybe find some places to get some drinks, and also some places to catch some live music around there. Now, when I came into downtown, they have this place called the Yard Food Truck Plaza. They had a whole event there with people and their booze, and uh, you could find some live music there as well. I kept walking around, and I finally ended up trying out this place called Treno Pizzeria and Tap Room. It's a bit chaotic inside. Every single person is going around ordering food on the kiosk and picking up their food and serving their own beer. But once I escaped from that chaos inside and found a seat outside, I really enjoyed that pizza. They do make really good pizza there. And they had Jen Corta playing. She's a really talented musician from Temple, and she was telling some stories about growing up in the area and the things that they experienced. Really gave a small town vibe to the unique experience that the kind of high school students get here, trying to socialize and have fun in a pretty small town. Ultimately, I made it down to Moose and Goose Winery. This is a bit of a drive from the downtown Temple area. Kind of interesting of a drive. You're going down a kind of gravel road and uh, surrounded by nature. You can even spot some cows out there. And when you get to Moose and Goose, there's a big open spaces. They got a stage right there in the middle with a bunch of tables. They got a food truck out there serving food to people. And a nice little uh, building where they got all their wine bottles for sale. Making those fruit wines there. That's their specialty. And even though their name says Moose and Goose, I didn't see any mooses or gooses. But I did find some goats. They've got goats there that you can look at and go and walk around with. So it kinda had a nice feel there, felt like you're escaping, and I enjoyed playing my songs out there to uh, the folks that were hanging out. Every day I wake up and try to figure it out. Drink a cup of coffee and then I jump into the shower. Every day I wander, I wander down the road. I gon' get up, pack it up and go Cause I've been to Omaha and I've been to Des Moines I've seen the Mississippi all the way in Illinois Spent time in Memphis and I've been to New Orleans but the places that I think about are the places that we've been. Now I'm posting about my experiences touring around Texas and I'm trying to uncover the Texas music scene here on my YouTube channel. So be sure to check out my channel page and all the tons of videos that I've got about Texas music. Hit that subscribe and the bell button to stay tuned on my posts here. Let me know in the comments what else I should check out. And thanks for your support. On down the road, when I gonna get up, pack it up and go.